but man, yeah. Well, although they have to be because they're you know they're on the equator and they don't have any weather. But it's a big different from the floor of Mendoza to the to that part, right? Yeah, about forty degrees. Yeah. <laughs> and it's still not as cold as like Salta up way north. So here, uh, this this thing got a huge reviews at the uh, tasting the other day. This is uh, first I thought it was Sauvignon Blanc altogether, but no, it's not. It's, it's, uh, it's a blend of Rome Vrindle, yeah, yeah. Grenache Blanc and a few other things. Um, Duché de Duz, which is the district, uh, and uh, it's Domaine Saint Fermat. Fermat. It's another another wine from ah, the notes. I remember this. This is like just like. A coconut, pineapple, mango, guava explosion. I mean, it's another wine from the Provence, and a white from the Provence, which was ab- literally unheard of 20 years ago. I mean, there maybe were five producers in the, in, in the Provence. Uh, it's absolutely delicious wine. So good. Yeah, but this is a blend of several different grapes, a Grenache Blanc, I think, um, um, uh, Viognier, yeah, and, uh, and either Roussan or Marsan, you know, and... It's and you know, it's, it's interesting. It's like a chef putting together a little taste of this and this to make a dish that has beginning, middle, and end. And that's what winemakers do. But I'm getting this candy nose, like cotton candy. Yeah, nose. exactly. There is a candy, almost a minty kind of quality to it. Mm. You want to keep tasting it. And I'm trying to ma- I'm trying to pair it with, uh, I don't know, like a cream sauce of some kind of fettuccine or something. Oh, sure. Oh, I'd, I'd love to have this with Tom Yum soup and a little spice to it. and coconut. Oh, yeah, milk. right. Oh, uh, uh, curried soup, actually. Curry's right up there, too. So, yeah, I'm at a 98, uh, 24 dollars on the shelf, $13.99 reorder price. That is a killer bottle of wine for $13.99. I forgot where I got this.